the latest Continental represents a giant leap forward, and now offers genuine driver engagement alongside the expected GT Brief. Just over 15 years ago Bentley produced its first all-new car under the ownership of VW, and it was called the Continental GT. Based on the same platform as the VW Phaeton Executive Saloon it proved to be a good car, but not a great one, not even when it was revised and significantly improved in 2011. Now, though, the Condi GT has been completely re-engineered, to a point where Bentley claims the car is 100% brand new which is a good thing because it faces plenty of competition in the form of cars as diverse as Aston Martin DB11 and the Ferrari GTC4 Lusso. And the good news is the Bentley looks, drives and feels a whole lot better this time round, even in this pre-production form. Tech Highlights And that, explains Bentley's Director of Chassis Engineering, Keith Sharp, has made a massive difference to the end product. It's fair to say that we, Porsche and Bentley engineers, worked together on the project right from the word go, so right at the beginning of the concept stage we were involved says Sharp. Hence the reason Sharp and his team are so confident in the way a new GT drives, even if does still weigh a very long way the other side of 2 tons. Engine, transmission and 0 to 60 miles per hour time. At its heart the Condi GT is still powered by a 6.0 liter twin turbo W12. But despite featuring the same capacity and a similar fundamental design as the previous W12, it is genuinely a brand new engine, made it to a brand new dual-clutch gearbox that is essentially Bentley's interpretation of a Porsche Panamera's 8-speed dual-clutch. But the way in which the power and torque is deployed has been radically altered in the new car, and switching between the three different drive modes available is key to the distribution of energy, and to the personality of the car in general. What's it like to drive? In sport mode the new GT feels, well, not quite like a full-blown sports car but at the very least like an extremely sporting GT car. Prices and Rivals It is quite a car, is the new Bentley Continental GT. For approximately £156,000 you could even call it a bargain. That's the same money that Aston Martin asks for a V8 DB11, which is easily the best DB11, but which is still not especially close to being as good as the new Convi GT is. Then there's the Ferrari GTC Lusso, which is a fine machine, but can't match the Bentley for all round of value, appeal or pure ability. For sure, this is the best GT car in the world right now.